Hi, I'm Sarah Moran with Equity Title Biltmore Office, and I am bringing you news you should know for closure data through the end of May 2012. So let's go ahead and uh, look at this chart um, and figure out what it is telling us. We're just going to start here at the top of the purple line. This represents all current default properties. So any property that has received a notice of trustee sale and has not either sold, um, gone back to the bank, or canceled the trustee sale. So at the end of May 2012, there were 17,439 active default residential properties. This is down just slightly from the previous month by about 330 units. Um, but it is uh, definitely decreased from the all-time high of 47,606. Next, let's look at this light blue line, and this represents residential REO properties. Um, this is going to be all of the properties that are currently um, owned by the bank. So they were given a notice of trustee sale, they went to auction, they did not sell at auction, the bank took them back. So um, it's currently what the bank owns. Um, there are 6,169 REO properties. Um, this is down by about 540 units from last month, so we did see a drop there. Um, and if you look back to May of 2011, there were at that time um, about 18,451 REO properties. So we are down about 67% from this point in, in just one year. Now, if you are looking at uh, what is actually, what the bank owns and, and it, within that, what um, is not currently available either uh, you know for sale in the MLS either as active or pending let's just break this number down a little bit more um, there are right now 1247 REO properties that are listed as active in the MLS and there's an additional 1811 REO properties that are in the pending status in the MLS so what that means is that the bank currently owns about 3,100 REO properties um, that are not in the MLS or for sale yet. So that's that shadow inventory, um, about 3,000 properties. Now, if we look at the next line, the dark blue line, that is monthly residential notices. Um, you can see it, it's about the same, maybe just upticked slightly last month. Um, and then if you look at the residential canceled, this has been pretty flat for the, the past four or five months here. That's the green line. That's the number of properties that have received a notice of trustee sale, but then it cancels for whatever reason. So it could be that they've caught up on their payments or it's sold as a short sale and it's a bank approved short sale. So they cancel out that notice of trustee sale. Um, finally, let's look at the red line, which is um, residential foreclosed. That's the one month number of foreclosures. Um, last month, there were 2,001 uh, foreclosures that occurred. This was up just slightly from uh, the previous month when there were about 350. So we did see that number of, the, of what the bank is actually taking back. Um, at the trustee sale rather than selling to a third party uh, went up just slightly. So that is my report. Um, again, I am Sarah Moran with Equity Title Biltmore Office. There are many ways that I can assist you, uh, but probably most importantly, uh, my escrow officers can close your transactions. I have three excellent escrow officers, Kathy Stewart, Don Robinson, and Stephanie Ritter, and um, they are a great uh, team to have. So if you need any help, please let me know. My number is 602-769-1438.